Hey guys, I hope you're having a wonderful Sunday so far. I am here with a word of encouragement for you like I pop on every Sunday um, with my Let's Be Real episode. So today's topic is to do something every day. And um, I just wanna encourage your hearts like I do every week, like I said. Uh, so my husband is a real estate investor and he normally you know, flips houses or wholesales properties um, so right now he is um, doing his uh, first new build. So he's building from the ground up and then he's planning on selling. And he's got several projects um, in the works where he's going to be doing this. And he was talking to a friend of his who is experienced in building homes. And he told my husband, you got to do something every day, you know, to keep the momentum going um, in order for you to you know, achieve the maximum outcome outcome as far as your time and, you know, the workers and getting things done, you know, in a certain time frame, do something every day. So that was a word of encouragement that he gave him. And when I got up this morning to pray and I was just talking to the Lord, um, I always ask the Lord, you know, what is the word that he has for me today? And today he told me, do something every day. And so um, I was just reading in scripture and the Lord was just reminding me how there are blessings that he has waiting for me, right? He's already there in the future. He's been trying to get me to these things, these blessings that I've been waiting on, but I have to do my part. And he told me in all areas of my life, I need to do something every day, be consistent. So I am consistent in praying every day for the salvation of our friends and loved ones. Like I hop on and do a live every day. But the Lord told me that's just one area of your life. There are many other areas where I'm wanting to see some growth and some change happen. And he told me that I need to do something every day. So specifically like, you know, be it in my health or in my business, if I want to see the change and achieve the momentum that I'm trying to achieve, I have to do something every day. And so that is my challenge to you this week. Do something every day. Like earlier this year, um, I got consistently working out and, you know, changed up my diet. Um, but like I had a, um, a illness and it just really affected me. I was in so much pain where I couldn't go to the gym and I just really, I couldn't work out for some time because of all the pain that I was in and what I was dealing with. And I just kind of gave up on it and hadn't worked out in quite a long time. And the Lord's like, you know, you need to get back on it. Be more consistent. You do something every day. You know, when the challenges come, just like that situation came, it threw me for a loop. I wasn't expecting that. It just came out of the blue. But the Lord showed me through that experience that there's still something that I can do. I might not be able to, at that time, I might not have been able to go to the gym and work out the way that I was once doing it, but there was something that I could do. And so that is my challenge to you. There is something that you can do, no matter what situation you're in or what goal you're trying to achieve, do something every day that's gonna help you get a little bit closer to that goal. So, um, you know, be it in your health, be it in your finances, like I said, be it in your business, if you're in school, um, do something every day that'll get you one step closer to where you're trying to go and what you're trying to do. God is already there. He's already um, positioned the blessing for you, but we have to do our parts, right? So we have to get moving. We have to be consistent and do something every day. And like I said, this is in every area area of our lives and even specifically um, spiritually that's one thing that we forget we need to consistently read our bibles every day we need to consistently pray and talk to god and listen to what he has to say we need to content consistently worship offer praise and worship to him um you know people will say i just remember when i was growing up my dad used to always you know say this phrase about I'm waiting for my ship to come in. And um, I remember him preaching a sermon once and he was saying people are waiting for their ship to come in, but they have to be there. You know, like it's not just going to fall in your lap. You have to do your part. You might be waiting for your ship to come in, but if you're not at the dock when the ship comes then you're going to miss it, right? 
You're not going to be able to get what you're waiting on um, if you're not there and you're not prepared to receive it. So be consistent. Do something every day. I hope that this blesses and encourages you as it has blessed me. Um, when my husband got that advice, I thought, you know, that's a, that's really some good advice. And then when the Lord spoke that to me, I was like, that makes so much sense. And I just got this revelation and just like, you know, the bells went off. And so that's what he wanted me to share with you guys today. So do something every day. I hope you have a very blessed week and I will see you back here next Sunday for another episode of Let's Be Real. Blessings. Bye-bye.